Hey guys, this is the Duplicolor Daily Driver Series and I'm Matt Steele. Now let's face it, we would all love to do a full vehicle restoration, but two things get in the way of that most of the time, time and money. That's where this Daily Driver Series comes in because you got to drive something every day, right? Case in point, 2004 F-150 work truck. It's been a lot of good service over the last couple of years. It had a drop-in bed liner in there. So outside, I took that thing out and you can see all the junk that was up underneath it. We're talking about bark and mulch and dirt and rocks. All this stuff will get wet and it'll stay wet and it's not going anywhere because it's trapped underneath that bed liner and that's going to cause a lot of corrosion in the bed of your truck. Well, that is where this comes in. It's Duplicolor Bed Armor. Now, once we get this installed in the bed of this truck, that's something we'll never have to worry about again. Applying the bed armor is very similar to a painting project in that the prep work is very, very important and you want to make sure that you do it right. Now when it comes to the prepping of this particular vehicle, the kit comes with a scuff pad and that works fine and that will get the job done. But if you want to speed the process up and get it done a little bit quicker, you can break out the power tools and take the wire wheel to the bed of the truck. Now you don't have to get all the paint off and you don't have to get down to the bare metal. You just want to knock down that clear coat and make a nice surface for the bed armor to stick to. Once you're done with that, you will hit it with the prep spray and just spray it down and then wipe it all out. You'll get rid of all the dust and everything else that's there. Now your surface is good and ready to start laying on some of the bed armor. Here's another good idea. When you pick up the kit of bed armor, make sure you also pick up one of these. It's the bed armor in the aerosol can. That way we can use this to get into the corners and the hard to reach places and it's going to save us a lot of time in the process. Once you get that first coat on, you want to let it dry for at least an hour or so before you apply the second coat. We actually waited a little bit longer than that so that I could get back up here and walk around and I wouldn't get it all over my shoes. Now, if you take a look close, you can see underneath that first coat, you see a little bit of the white paint from the bed of the truck. Don't get worried about that because that's only the first coat. We'll lay the second coat on good and thick and that's going to cover up all the white. It's going to be nice and rich and black and it's going to offer all the protection that we want for this truck bed. This job is done, it looks great, and this is going to be a welcome addition to this truck. Now, let me tell you a couple of things that I really like about the bed armor. First of all, it's water-based, so when you're applying it, if you get some somewhere where you don't want it, as long as it's still wet, you just wipe it off and keep going. Secondly, it's made with UV inhibitors, so it's not going to fade on you. And third, it's the only do-it-yourself bed liner that's made with Kevlar, so you know it's strong and you know it's going to hold up. Now, this kit comes with everything that you need to do the job. It's got everything to do a standard six-foot bed in the truck. Now, we had an eight-foot bed here, so we opted for the extra quart. That way, we didn't run short. We wanted to have enough to make sure that we did the job right. Now, if you really want to step up the whole timing of it all, you can get this optional air gun. You hook that to your compressor, and you can really knock this out quickly. You know, we did this today, and we saved a ton of money in the process, and that is exactly what it's all about with this whole Daily Driver series. For more information about bed armor or any of the other Duplicolor products, be sure to check out their website.